My name is Johanan Gaddy. It's almost like, to me, um, expressionism in the same way that a person might keep a journal to write about something as a way of dealing with it. You know, I can express that feeling in a painting in a healthy way and then gives me a way to look at my own feeling and then reflect about it and then to learn from my own experience and from my own feelings. or completely abstract paintings are a lot of times about that same sort of thing that feeling of what it's like to see something or feeling of what it's like to experience something or sometimes even just a feeling of you know an emotion or a psychological state that you might experience just as a human being or we call it experiencing joy and pain and all these different, you know, whole range of emotions that we have. In my exhibit here, I have kind of a range of different styles. The first style that I worked in that I got really interested in was Impressionism. And I have one oil painting that's impressionistic and a little bit abstracted, um, which is what I'm drawn to. What's the point of painting a picture that looks like a photograph? I've already taken the photograph. And then if you look at some of my other pieces, maybe um, two or three other one other pieces in the show that you could call um, figurative, I guess. When you look at them. They may show, they may depict something that is realistic, but not in a realistic manner. They're very abstracted. At the same time, sometimes when you're being very expressive, especially with abstract expressionism, it can go so far that kind of lose the viewer, like, I got that for a long time, um, people would just look at my art and they'd just be dumbfounded, they just, they didn't know where to start with it, like, so I kind of realized that I had to make some kind of compromise in where I gave people something that they could relate to, something they could, you know, make a comparison of that to something they had seen before, or something they experienced before. Mostly for me, what makes one painting, like the ones that I picked for this show, stronger than other paintings that I may have done and painted over or thrown away, would be that um, they, they hold up um, aesthetically as well as being expressive at the same time. So um, they're not just pretty pictures, you know, and feel finished, but they also, there's something more to it. There's something that draws you into it that makes you want to come back and look at it again and again and maybe see something different each time you look at it. The paintings sort of develop in a life of their own. Like, I may start something that's completely abstract or almost completely abstract. I don't really have a set idea of what it's supposed to look like when it's done, but I'm, I'm in a way maybe discovering something about myself while I'm doing it that, you know, wasn't consciously there in my mind. It rises, you know, to the surface of my mind by actually seeing it on the canvas.